My friends, allow me the honor to be the first to welcome you to the Krim Republic, where culture and magicanical technology thrive. Decisions, decisions. Right. My friends, your opinions on this matter would be greatly appreciated. I agree that delivering our report should be our very first move. Please, lead the way. I agree that getting the Soul Gem to the Institute of Thaumaturgy should be our very first move. Let us cut across the Fountain Piazza. Greetings, Archbishop. It has been a while. Esteemed delegates, allow me to introduce to you Archbishop Cream Cookie, the voice of the Republic's faith. We are currently en route to the Lyceum for an audience with the Elders. Thank you for your concern, Elder Millifoy Cookie. I present to you Elder Millifoy Cookie, one of the nine members of the Convocation of Elders. Indeed, the ancient heroes have agreed to my terms. We have brought their soul jam, the legendary artifacts of mysterious power. These soul jams seem to be receptacles for their noble souls. They are secured in an enchanted reliquary to ensure a safe and, may I add, discreet transit. How fares our beloved city? I hope all has been well during my absence. What? Monsters? Elder Millifoy Cookie. Archbishop Cream Cookie. Pardon my urgency, but may I ask that you watch over our cargo until we return? We must assess the situation at once. A golem just appeared in the middle of the city. This has never happened before. This is indeed disturbing. It seems like any other ordinary day, but within moments, chaos erupted in the middle of our fair city. Almost as if... by design. <gasps> Quickly, we must return to the Divine Sanctum at once. Who dare? The Soul Gem! Is the Soul Jam safe? Those masked cookies must have taken it. We need to hunt them down. Now! Ginger Brave, we have no time to formulate a strategy. We must continue the pursuit. A wise plan. Let us rendezvous back at the Sanctum afterwards. <sighs> My friends, I am glad to see everyone here. Is everyone safe and sound? With great success. The masked fiend I chased was holding it tight. Let us speak without physical altercation. I am sorry. I failed to predict this sequence of events. I had attached an anti-tracking device to the reliquary as a precaution, but I never imagined they'd remove the soul gem from the reliquary itself. You have my word. I will take the utmost caution to prevent such incidents from occurring again. Very well. Let us head to the Institute at once. The Institute of Thaumaturgy is the largest and most well-financed laboratory of magic in the Republic. It is not an exaggeration to say that this facility paves the way for a better future. Espresso Cookie, how will you be proceeding with your research? You have my full support in this endeavor. I doubt I need to remind you of all cookies, but time is of the essence. I already recruited a team of the finest researchers beforehand. They will assist you in your research. Now then, let us make way for an audience with the Elders. I am certain they are eager to hear of our return. The Elders will have many questions for you about Soul Gem. You are the only one capable of providing an answer to assuage any qualms they may have. I assure you it will not take long, Espresso Cookie. Venerable Elders, thank you for granting us this audience. Without further ado, I shall deliver my report on the summit held at the Vanilla Kingdom. I've invited Sir Madeline Cookie and Espresso Cookie to provide their input as well. Now then, upon my arrival at the summit. And thus, we have succeeded in transporting the Soul Jam to our Republic. They are safely secured in the Institute of Thaumaturgy, and we have already begun a detailed analysis. The Institute of Thaumaturgy will proceed with its research at full speed. No expenses will be spared. 
No equipment will be unused. The energy contained within Soul Jam will be scrutinized to the smallest granule of sugar. We must then find a way to safely harness a portion of this energy for other cookies to use. If we succeed, cookies all over Earthbread will have the strength to stand up against Dark Enchantress Cookie. Correct. We are working on borrowed time, and must take full advantage to research its power. The ancient heroes still have a full say in all matters of the Soul Gem. Their proposal left us no room for error. Ah, uh, uh, pardon me for the lack of introduction. These cookies are delegates from the Dark Cow and Hollyberry Kingdoms. They are here to ensure the safety of the ancient hero Soul Gem. Yet, I personally am not. There is still an enigma that perplexes me. Amassed cookies from before. Their movements were far from haphazard. They moved methodically, and their strike was coordinated. It seemed as if they knew when and where we would be, and how the Soul Jam was being transported. What's more, the reliquary was enchanted with some of the strongest hexes and security devices known to the Republic. And they cut through it all, like a knife through butter. No one knew of such details, except for the Elders. Nothing more than speculation at the moment. Without more details, we would only come to an erroneous conclusion. But I cannot purge this thought from my mind. There is a veil of duplicity and deceit surrounding us. Words are a powerful tool. They are also a window into one's soul. Perhaps we can uncover more through dialogue. However, my administrative duties restrain me from ascertaining the full truth on my own. I ask for your assistance and cooperation in investigating the Elders. I shall speak with Elders Oyster and Custard Cookie. Would you be willing to approach the others? I have a rising suspicion that each Elder has made their own personal conclusions about Soul Jam. Perhaps they will unwittingly reveal their intentions. You have my sincerest thanks. Now then, Espresso Cookie. I trust that you will begin your research the moment you return to the Institute. Mind you, there are many eyes carefully watching every turn of this research. Your results will surely influence Earthbred's politics, as well as other spheres of life. I know you were eager to begin. But I must ask, not just for formality, will you be able to handle such a tremendous task? Can I ask you to bring a new age of peace and prosperity to all cookies of Earthbread? An excellent idea, Sir Madeline Cookie. I hope everyone may rest and recuperate well at Mansion Madeline. Good morning, my friends. How fared your first night in the Krim Republic? A nightmare. I believe there is some time before the ceremony begins. Shall we proceed to the Institute to learn for ourselves? And after. You each remember what I asked yesterday, yes? Each of us must engage in deep conversation with the Elders. Father, I have returned. How have you fared in my absence? I trust that all is well? Yes. Our party was ambushed by a group of unknown assailants in white masks while transporting the Soul Jam. We successfully retrieved the Soul Jam from said assailants, but we have yet to identify the culprits. I was unaware of the existence of such a group within our Republic. To prevent such mishaps from occurring, I intend on taking extra precautions and fully investigating the matter, both internally and externally. No. The investigation is ongoing. We are receiving eyewitness accounts from cookies who were at the Sanctum and the Piazza. Another effort is being made to identify cookies capable of breaching the reliquary. Understood. Greetings. I have sent word to Elder Oyster Cookie in advance requesting an audience. May I enter? Manor Oyster is as radiant as I remember. The glimmering of pearls throughout its halls is beautiful as always. 
Apologies, but I'm afraid I do not have the leisure for tea. I must soon return to my duties. <sighs> Truly, nothing can get past your sharp eyes and wit, Madam Oyster Cookie. Your insight shines brighter than the most valuable of pearls. I am compelled to inform you of an incident that occurred while transporting the Soul Jam. Unknown assailants, concealing their faces in masks of white, ambushed us and stole the Soul Jam. Though we successfully recovered the Soul Jam, my mind continues to dwell on the ambush. They seemed to be moving according to an agreed plan. I do not. However, no one outside the Convocation of Elders knew of our mission to retrieve the Soul Jam. In other words, an Elder is directly involved in this incident. I am certain that you, Elder Oyster Cookie, are not responsible. What have you to gain from such subterfuge? House Oyster is the wealthiest and most influential house in the Krim Republic. Why engage from the shadows with a group of masked cookies? Hence the reason for the utmost caution, madam. I have asked the delegates from the kingdoms to assist in a discreet investigation. I understand. Ah, oh, my friends. I see you have returned. How fares Espresso Cookie's research? This is welcome news. It is Espresso Cookie we're talking about, after all. Have you had a chance to discuss matters with the Elders? I too have yet to discover anything of significance. I am still quite certain that the Convocation of Elders is involved. Their intentions are not easy to discern. I see. At least, when observed from afar, the research into Soul Jam is proceeding without too much difficulty. But, of course, I am only speaking as if I am an outside observer. The truth is that without identifying our masked assailants, we must remain vigilant until the research is concluded and the Soul Jam is returned to its rightful owners. For now, I shall retire to my quarters. I advise you get some rest too, my friends.